Well, now to the very latest on the case of a man accused of driving drunk and slamming into a group of Good Samaritans who were there helping to get a car out of a ditch. Charges will be upgraded to intoxication manslaughter for 26-year-old Zachary Castro. He was in court today. Channel 2's Marianne Martinez was in court and is joining us now live with what happened. Marianne, good morning. Good morning. Well, a man who admitted to taking shots before getting behind the wheel of a car and later slamming into three people was in court today. Now, he's already charged with intoxicated assault, but we found out this morning that one of the three people he hit has been declared brain dead and is expected to die later. Zachary Castro was in court today accused of driving drunk and hitting three good Samaritans pulled over on the side of the road. Monday just before one in the morning three drivers stopped on Barker Cypress to help a disabled vehicle. Prosecutors say that's when Zachary Castro tried to pass them but ended up hitting the three good Samaritans who were out of their cars. Myra Espina ended up on the hood of Castro's truck and was thrown into a ditch. The 23 year old woman was declared brain dead and is expected to be pulled off a respirator later today. At that time, Castro will be charged with intoxicated manslaughter. Today, a judge upgraded Castro's bond to $25,000 for each person he hit and barred him from driving. All I'm going to say is that in the United States, uh, my client is innocent until proven guilty in the court of law. We're going to treat him as such. Now, a second Good Samaritan was also hospitalized. The third Good Samaritan who was hit had minor injuries. Reporting live from downtown, Marianne Martinez, KPRC, Channel 2 News.